Welcome back to Magnetic Max. So here I am on location, ready to fish. Man, it's hot. As you can tell, I'm sweaty like a pig. And as everybody knows, the sun don't like me. It burns me. So I have to wear a jacket so I could keep the hood up on the way here to stop me from getting burnt. I have got sun cream on. So I may be all right, I hope. But uh, the last time I was here, I found quite a lot. This is where I got me Bowie knife from. And I know it's never been fished, apart from when I've done it. And uh, Mr. Gray on Pickering. So hopefully you'll enjoy the video guys. Hopefully we get some good stuff and hopefully it's a long one. Enjoy. Wow, sweating. So right, I've only been here for, I don't know, 10, 15 minutes thereabouts. Got some good stuff already, look at this. I've got a knife there. Might clean that one, considering from the bow. I've got a nine mil there. Bits of change. Uh, spinner. Good old tool. My brain's gone blank this morning. Some bits there, and a few more bits there. So keep going, and hopefully we get some more. Good spot. Right, so I just sat down for five minutes and realized that bullet that I found, it's not a nine mil. It's a 38 Remington. That's an old one, that. Makes a change to finding nine mils. So yeah, Remington 38, lovely bullet. I've also found a horseshoe. Uh, I've got a second knife, just a kitchen one. I've got two of them now. And just a few more random bits there. So I'll bring you back again very soon if I find more, which I guarantee I'm going to. Enjoy. All right, back again. So there's a few more bits here. I've moved the bullet now. Um, but I'm going to move up into the lock and the opposite side of the lock. Let's see if I get out there. But I'll show you what's here first. Here we are. We've got a padlock now. A few other bits and bobs, fishing law. That's it really, a few more over there. So, let's move. Right, sweating like a pig. On the opposite side of the bridge, I mean, not the bridge, sorry, the other side of the lock. I did try inside, well much luck. But, I've just found something really cool. Look at this. Ready? I got a gat gun. Cool. I'm gonna take that home and clean it, for sure. Completely legal. Oh yeah! Going good! I'm gonna move up to the next location now. I'm gonna show you the last bits that I had here. I've got a very old scooter. If you can see it. That is a really old scooter. Fishing rod! And then just some little bits. Not much else. So off to the next location. Hopefully it's as good as this one. Especially with that gap. Enjoy! My God, I look a mess. Here I am, next location. I've saved a life today. This guy was drowning, but now he won't leave me alone. It's a blue dragonfly. Look at him, isn't that cool? Never held one of these before, but now he's just sort of drying off before he takes off again, I think. Yeah, cool. But he was just floating by, drowning, so I thought I'd rescue him. What are you doing? He's cleaning himself, look. What's he doing? That's funky, that. Alright, bring you back soon, guys, if we find anything. I've got a little friend. <laughs> he was drowning. So I thought I'd rescue him out of the water. Look at the colours on him. He's a bit filthy, but he's trying to clean himself off by the looks of it. Cool. Right, so far, I'm getting a messy head. Looking a bit red. It's not good. So, I've got three of those. Uh, I can't remember what you call them. I know for the, they're for the train tracks, though. I've got measuring tape. I've got an old cassette tape as well. And then something here. I'm not sure what that is. I have no idea about this sort of thing. Issue seven, three pound fifty. So yeah, don't know why it's got Leicester in it though. Cool. Move down a bit. See if we get out else. Right, got a few more bits. I wonder if anybody can tell me what this is. There's a train track above me. If this, if that helps. But this is the item. Who can tell me what that is? I'm pretty sure that belongs on the tracks though. 
who can tell me? A little weight to it, made out of wood. Hmm, not sure. I, I have no clue. That's what I say about train tracks. Got an old hub off a bike. Bit of circuitry. I'm gonna keep hunting. If we get some more good stuff, I wanna know what that wheel is. Let me know. All right, that's it, I'm finished. I'm gonna head home now. So the next time you see me will be when we do the clean up of the gap gun. So hopefully it turns out nice. Hopefully it looks good. Definitely gonna be a piece of my cabinet with all the rest of my stuff. So hopefully you've enjoyed the fishing part. Now hopefully you'll enjoy the outcome of the gap gun. So off my nice, uh, pretty much an hour ride home. Enjoy guys, and thank you for watching. All right, so here it is before cleaning. But to me, it looks like all the pieces are there as well because the breach and everything's still in there. You can't see it, but uh, I'm hoping if I clean it up well enough that it may still work. It's very possible. So keep tuned, guys. I'll keep you updated as much as I can. After I've cleaned it, you'll see it. And then we'll just have to see where it goes from there. So keep watching. Right, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video so far. I did try cleaning the gap gun, but uh, little pieces kept falling off it and little bits and bobs. And uh, I didn't want to spoil it too much, lot as you can see. Them little white spots. That one there on the barrel. Um, and then also, I'll show you the other side as well. I know it doesn't look much different, but it started happening pretty quick. There's another one. And another one. But you can see there's little lines across the end of that barrel. It does actually move in and out. Um, but the screws won't come undone or anything like that so I did try to see if I could get it so it, I could actually fire it but just weren't having it so it's still a good piece to keep because it is in one piece well most of it anyway uh, good piece of history as always so it's always nice to have a bit of history um, so yeah I know it's a short one I'm trying to get back out there I have got a couple of videos lined up for you um, it is with tripod. I know this one isn't because this was before I asked you guys. So it has took a little while. I do apologise. But the next one will be with tripod. Um, and I'm also going to be meeting a guest this weekend. So that should be fun. And I will be going to a location that I've not been to for a very long time. But I will be within boundaries of where I'm allowed to be. So that's good. Um, so until the next time guys. Remember to like, share, subscribe as usual. And remember, stay green. Bye.